Hello guys, good day. Welcome back to my YouTube channel. My name is Jennifer Blinky and um, in today's video, I want to show you a secret of how to make money if you're living abroad and you don't have a job. Guys, please don't mind me. I'm looking so stressed and tired. Yes, because I just got back and um, I had to follow my husband to a football pitch. Like, this man loves food, football. I don't know. Like, to have to follow him, I will sit here, wait for him while he play, And when he's done, we can go home together. So, I just came with my mic, my small tripod, so that I can make this video for you guys. And um, a jotter. So, let's proceed, guys. Um, here I have five side hustle you can do in abroad and make money. In fact, I do almost everything here, but only one is five I have here, but I'm currently doing four. But the last one I am not doing it, but I have someone that does it. Okay, now the first one is this is a unique side hustle that you won't even think of. But some of them are not unique, actually. Some of them are something that you already know already. So let's start. The first one is um, um, creating and selling t-shirts online, even when you are not physical there in Nigeria. You can sell, you can create and sell to anybody in the world. I sell my, my t-shirt business. Those that know me before know that I am a t-shirt printer from Nigeria. This this business is what I, I've been doing when since I was in school, since my undergraduate year, that's my final year, to my NYC. When I was serving Nigeria, I was doing this business. After my NYC, I moved to Lagos. I did it for like six months without a shop. Then, then up, like after my NYC, I have to get a shop, you know. I was in Lagos doing this business. After I got my first shop, I got a, a, another shop. I had three shops in Lagos before I closed one. Then I was managing two t shirt printing and, and branding shop. So I started doing, um, aside from the t shirt, I do mug, all these gift items, frame. Anything gift, I sell it. I create, print, and sell. So when I traveled, I did not stop. Eh? When I traveled, I only rebranded and I sell, even though I don't post on my social media anymore. You know, when I was starting, I used my social media as a platform of selling this business, that is this t-shirt printing. Um, I use my Facebook. If you go to my Facebook, you will see all my old posts where I was selling t-shirts. I make videos and everything that was then but when i move abroad i i strategize and i sell online in fact my customers are now global i sell on pinterest i sell i have an the online store where people order and sell even though nobody knows i am the owner of the business because i do it i don't post it online you understand because my audience are no longer the Nigerian people, even though my business is still active and my younger brother is managing it in Nigeria and they use their account number for the business. But I also manage my own online where I use my own account number for the business. You understand? So, this is you can do this business online if you don't know how to create an e commerce small website for your business. What you can do is to hire somebody, hire a small girl, place them in a shop, maybe where they sell all these t shirt this thing. Let them snap and send to you. You will sell online. They will help you package it and wear it to your customers. Apart from branding t shirt as I, I no longer brand t shirt I brand, but I've expanded. I sell even custom made, like something like this already made not printed by me i get nice design advertise it on my e-commerce website and people order from different parts of the world i don't do anything 
I only copy their link and place on my own website, not my. I don't know how to explain. There are so many websites that support you to do e-commerce. I don't. I don't want to mention my my business name on this um YouTube. Okay, it's personal. I don't want to put it out there. That is why you have never seen me for more than two years now. I have not posted T-shirt on my WhatsApp or Facebook. Okay, but my 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 staff in Nigeria they used to post. They post. And they sell, they deliver. For me, I don't do that anymore. But I sell on my own farm. Please find out how you can create an e-commerce website and sell online. If you, if you cannot do that, then get someone, a small girl, and place them in a shop in Nigeria. Let them send you pictures of items. Get pictures from Pinterest. Market it, sell, print, and they will deliver to you. Okay. Now, the second one is content creation. Content creation is one of the ways of making money online in 2024. Several times I've talked about content creation. YouTube, Facebook, TikTok. Okay, people are making large money there. I myself, my accounts are monetized. I, even though I am not having making all the money in the world, but the money I make on the social media is still something. Okay, it's it's kind of a side hustle that is um as an is encouraging. So I will advise you to go into content creation in 2024. Go online and search more about content creation. Okay. Um. Now, number three is um, if there is any skill that you know how to do very well, you can be if you're a pastor, if you're a doctor, if you are a painter. It can be get a skill, get a skill that you might people might love to know about. Like me, I'm into travel. You know, I do travel. Then create a community. You can invite people for consultation. Tell them what they don't know. From my consulting platform, I've saved so many people from scams. I've saved so many Nigerians from scams. So I tell them some things that they don't know about. Okay. Also, you can do training. I've done training. I did. I used to do training about when I was in Nigeria. I did T-shirt printing and branding training. I even have an ebook where people can learn, learn on how to print T-shirts. That was then. So all these things, you can. I've moved past this one. That is why I don't. You can't sneak post them in anymore. I am an e-commerce T-shirt seller. You understand? I no longer do the manual own. But when I was in Nigeria, I used to do training. I trained more than 100 people, and each person paid me 50,000 naira. I, I said 100 is too small. I trained up to 200 women in Nigeria. And, uh, in the, and I did training there. I did training how to print t shirts and design. Okay? I also um, sold ebook to them. Now, apart from all this one, you can also do, you can sell jobs in abroad, like me now. When I got to Vietnam, I got a job, but that job was giving me stress. I have to sell it. I sold that job for $100. You can get jobs and sell to people. Like, that, so that, that was a time I posted a job about construction. Guys that came to me, the guy that brought the job added his profit. And I, me too, I have to add small profit. You understand? You can make money from all these things. Go around and hustle for jobs for people. Look for jobs, job, and people that can, like me, now I can't do some kind of minor job. But if someone that can do it is available, I can help them get it and they pay me for the job. You can also do airport pickup and accommodation. You understand? You can help people search for accommodation in, in wherever you are, in UK, Canada, Vietnam, anywhere you are, and they will pay you for it. They will pay you a token for it. Now, another business you can, you can think of is food business. There was a time I was advising some ladies to do food business in, in Vietnam, but they were slow. Before you know it, someone even in my company was selling food. I was like, wow, I was so impressed with the lady that she's selling food, Nigerian food. So if you go to a place like this abroad where we have Africans and Nigerian food are not common, you can start selling food, you know, locate their, their market, buy things very cheap, you know. And sell and make money. Our people, even if it's not a full time job, you can use um, cooking as a part time puzzle. Okay? Now, 
What next, guys? It is time to start right now. Start now. That teacher business is a very good business. I do teacher business. I do content creation. Before, I used to carry my, my business on my head. But now, I no longer do those things. But I sell. Do you know one thing about this e-commerce site? Those e-commerce e -commerce websites, you will not do anything. You just have to post your sample, your um, your t-shirt there. And people you don't know from anywhere will order it. At the end of the month, you will have your commission sent to your account. All you have to do, add your small, maybe, it's a, let's say now, this company is selling t-shirts for $2,000, example. You will now add it. Copy it and paste in your own e-commerce website and sell your own for like um, $3,000. Now, people will order that um, that that t-shirt from me. At the end of, I won't do, I won't do anything. They will order. My own is, is to place, place the t-shirt there. Now, after ordering, the company will do the way be and everything. At the end of the month, I will get my all the money, all the extra money added on that t-shirt. To be sent to my account every month you get so go and find that you know eh, i'm so busy and occupied i would have loved to train people on how to do this thing but not anymore i have so many things i do you see i look so crafty because i've been busy i've, I've not even sleep yet i slept today once i get home now i will sleep i'm very busy you understand i'm very very busy with my own personal things so thinking of somebody else now I can I cannot cope. So please go online and search of how to be um start up a, an e-commerce website where you can sell t-shirts, other things. You can be any product. It is near most is t-shirt. I only use t-shirt as an example. As an example, you understand. So that is it. Okay. I hope I hope this my little point helps us. Okay. I will continue dishing out useful information to you guys. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel so you can get more of the day, okay? Bye-bye, guys.